Hello guys, and today I will teach you, and you will hopefully learn, how to decode slash read the enchantments. Um, before I start, I just want you to know that this does not tell you what enchantment you will get. So, um, I just think this is a fun, cool way to uh, turn these random letters into English or maybe your language probably English if you're watching this video so let's learn how um from the way I have it uh, it only works if you have a texture pack um but it's easy because I have a link down in the, in the description um of how to get a custom uh, resource pack which is the default um so, uh, right now I have, uh, this, uh, resource pack, not the default, um, and you see I can't read anything. So, let's learn how to do it. First, you want to go to, uh, your Minecraft folder. If you do not know how to do that, for the Windows, you, um, go into the search button, um, right that should be right here and you um and you uh type in sla uh, percent app data percent then you want to press enter and it sh there should be a folder saying roaming or you should already be in the, that folder then you want to click on the dot minecraft and for the uh for mac users open up finder and go to a library application support and then Minecraft. Now I have a me a very messy Minecraft folder because I do a lot of mods and weird stuff like that. So yours might be a little cleaner, but you want to find the resource uh, resource packs folder. You want to open it, and you want to open up the the resource pack. Then you want to go to assets, Minecraft, and this also works with um other texture packs too and now you want to go to um, textures and when you're here you want to click on the font uh, this folder has a lot of things and I think what what they mostly are yes they are just the um, other languages so as you see this is other languages that I don't understand um, but these three I know uh, this one's already not English. This, these three are all, um, already English. So, if you look at the first one, this will look familiar if you do a lot of enchantments. It is the, um, alphabet, I guess, in enchantments, which is the galactic alphabet, actually. It's from a game, I believe. And this is, I think, the normal English, um, alphabet, or the English font. I guess and this um it's about the same thing I'm not sure uh, basically what you want to do is just delete this you don't need the ashy um, thing now you just want to duplicate this um, duplicate it now you want to name it uh, a s c i i then underscore c g I mean S G A. I'm sorry. Um, and that was the name of um uh, that folder uh, we just threw out. So basically, is you made it so um this English uh thing, I guess language, is now also what's supposed to be in the enchantments. So you've basically replaced the old enchantments um folder or file, I guess um with English and now if you want to do it with other languages um I think you just copy like if you want uh, I'm sorry I, I'm not sure what language exactly this is I think it's like special characters but if you want that uh, you might have to um, copy it into it you might have to duplicate it and just name it a s c i i underscore s g a Um, that name is the a very important so now let's go back into my main world 
and hopefully uh, once we enter this and put our sword in here you see we can read this and it does not make sense at all uh that's the fun of it so let's get let's enchant my stuff if you want to know how to do this um this enchantment room i will hopefully have a link in uh, like an annotation or a link in the description um for maybe a tutorial or a showcase i actually haven't uploaded that video yet um but just let's see hold on we want 15 Air, darkness, grow, something. Sharpness, four. Knock back, two. Not bad. Grow, bless, and begin. Fortune, three. Not bad. The fire, water, heat. That is a very interesting name. For efficiency, four. Uh, that's good. And humanoid, spirit, undead, light. That is very interesting. Spirit and light kind of go together. Humanoid and undead is weird. And we got a beast of an axe. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, please follow me on Twitter. That stuff will be down in the description. And please leave a like if you enjoyed it, or and if it worked, maybe if you have any problems, just tell me. I did my best to also show how to do it on Windows, which is not that hard. Um, and yeah, if you really really enjoyed it, uh, please subscribe and check out my other videos. Thanks for watching.